Okay, so we're going to make some mini cupcakes in our ninja cooking system here, and it came with this silicone mini cupcake pan. So we're going to make them and see how it turns out. Okay, first you will need your cake mix of choice, some cooking spray, and two cups of water. Okay, so when you mix up your cake mix um, for the ninja cooking system, you will use half of the oil or butter it says on the package. So this says one third cup, so we're going to do half of one third cup of oil, whatever that equals out to be. Okay, so we are cooking, we are stirring, uh, mixing up the batter, the uh, cake mix as stated on the box, with the exception of halving the amount of butter or oil the uh, box calls for. So we'll mix it up and then uh, we'll get the cooker ready to cook. Okay, so we've got our cake mix just about ready. Ours might have a little baby slobber in it, but we're just adding some love to the cupcakes. So, okay, so now we want to uh, spray the little cupcake pan with a light coating of the non-stick cooking spray. So we take our two cups of water and pour it in the bottom of the Ninja cooking system. Okay, so now we are filling our mini cupcake pan with the cake batter. You want to get them each little cup about half full. Ours might not be so accurate. Okay, so next you're going to set it to oven and then you're going to set it to the highest cooking temperature recommended on your cake batter box which in our case is 350. So we will set our mini cupcake pan on the little rack and set it for 15 minutes. we're going to set it for 15 minutes and then you'll want to check it after 10 minutes to see if they're done. And if not then you'll leave it in for the remaining. So on goes the lid and there it goes. Okay, so it has been 10 minutes, and now we're going to take off the lid and check them out. We're going to poke a toothpick in them to see if they stick. And it looks like they are sticking a little bit, so we're going to leave them in for a couple more minutes. Okay, it's been two more minutes, so we're rechecking. Okay, my wife says they're done. <laughs> so... They are done. So be very careful when you're checking them and removing them from the uh, the Ninja because the steam is extremely hot and will burn you. Okay, so we had more batter left over and we didn't feel like cooking uh, 60 little mini cupcakes because that would take a while. So we have these silicone uh, cupcake holders or bakers or whatever you want to call it. You need them even more. So we are going to try these out and see if they will do fine in these little bakers or whatever you call them I'm missing one. Hmm? Okay, so we will put the lid back on and set the timer ten. for 10 minutes because now that the Ninja is already heated up, the steam's going, it should take 10 minutes for any batch after the first batch. Okay, so I removed the little cupcakes from the uh, mini pan and... They are very soft and moist, and we'll try them out and see how they are. <laughs> what do you think? It's very good. <laughs> it's very good. Very moist. Very moist, very airy. Um, they're done, and they're good for you because it uses <laughs> half the oil. <laughs> and Baby says, 
Let me try. Okay, so let's check on our larger cupcakes and see how they are. See how they are doing. It's like clean. Wife says they're done. So it was easy to do. Um, they're healthier for you since you can reduce the amount of butter or oil in your cupcakes, and they're fast, and you don't have to worry about them catching on fire or burning them, so um, each cupcake is done to perfection. Hope this helped you. Bye!